Alex's Hearing Help Desk. Aha! I've got a call. Ahem. Hallux's Hearing Help Desk. Hi, Professor Hallux. What's the smallest bone in the human body? Interesting question. Maybe you can have a guess. Bones come in all sorts of shapes and sizes. Could the smallest bone be a rib? Bones come much smaller than ribs. What about the knobbly vertebrae which makes up your back? Wrong again. Might it be your fingers or even your toes? No, there are bones even smaller than your fingers and toes. One is a teeny tiny bone found in your ear. It's called the stapes and is smaller than a pea. At less than three millimetres long, it's shaped like a stirrup. In fact, that's where the word comes from. The word stapes is a Latin word for stirrup. This bone has got nothing to do with horses, although all animals have a similar bone. In humans, the stapes works with two other bones called the malleus and the incus. These bones, just like the stapes, are named after their shape. Malleus is the Latin word for hammer and incus is the Latin word for anvil. These bones are found in the middle ear and their job is to move sound waves that come from the outer ear to the inner ear. They also help make sounds quieter before they reach the inner ear. Together, these bones are called ossicles, which literally means little bones. Since they are in your middle ear, they're not the sort of bone you're likely to break. Although they are small, they're vital in helping us to hear. And by hearing, we can make sense of the world around us. Alex's Hearing Help Desk. Find out more about your ears and hearing at phonak.com.